All right, attention YouTube, time for a little smackdown for the bug players. As you can see, these two guys right here, I'm trying to decide on a color scheme for my Imperial Guard Army. The one on the right is a Dark Angels green and then uh, Tamiya uh, NATO green. And then the one on the left is basically the black on the shoulder pads and helmet is Orc Shade. And that stuff is so glossy and dark that that black looks like a green. So I'm not really sold with that. One of the guys at our local game store said maybe I should use like a tan. I'm open. Hope some of you guys send me some suggestions of what will go good with this light green color. So, and if you have any tricks on how to paint uh, flesh, uh, my flesh needs a little work. Anyways, this video is all about dye, buggy dye. We all know the Tyranids are coming out here in a couple of days, and I've been challenged to play a 1,750 point game, and I'm gonna put the smackdown on the bug player. This is my t mechanized guard list and I'm gonna run through it real quick and see what you guys think first thing we're gonna start with right here is the command chimera, chimera, chimera or chimera however you say the damn thing anyways it's got the stubber of course and inside the command squad it's got uh, a commander with melt -a bombs and a veteran I mean the command squad there's a medic in there with feel no you know that gives him feel no pain and then three plasma guns Moving on over here, also also there's going to be two uh, bodyguards in there. Bodyguards are sweet in this edition, so uh, we'll see. I think it'll do pretty well. That's my typical loadout. Then we come over here. This is that uh, NATO green I was telling you guys about. That's my first uh, tank I'm experimenting with. Anyways, you can see four more chimeras, and three of them have, of course, they have the multi-lasers, and then they all have... Pental mounted stubbers, and then inside each one is a veteran squad with three Meltas. Typically, these squads go after the tanks and stuff, but the Meltas, I'm worried about being a little close to the big bugs. So I get three shots. That's not enough to drop a monstrous creature, but you know, hopefully, shots from the multi lasers will soften them up, and then I can come in and and put the smack down on the buggies. And then this this Chimera, Chimera uh, actually is going to have three flamers in it. This will help uh, take out some of the small bugs. And it, and it also has a veteran squad. Then over here we have two of the old style Hellhounds. They're kitted out with heavy bolters up front and then of course the Inferno cannons. This right here will be good against uh, medium and little bugs and with them being fast they should be able to take out quite a bit of his guys. And now we're going to move on to heavy support. Then over here we have two of the old style Hellhounds. They're kitted out with heavy bolters up front and then of course the inferno cannons this right here will be good against uh... medium and little bugs and with them being fast they should be able to take out quite a bit of his guys and now we're going to move on to heavy support uh... he's not shown he's hiding he's waiting to be deployed so what we're going to do is against the big bugs i'm not sure i'm hoping hopefully marbo can get into some zone throats or the new hive guard or whatever the ones that are good at shooting and uh... like basically their missile launchers strength eight assault twos so hopefully that's going to be marbo's targets but anyways guys let me know what you think about my seventeen fifty list like i said i've played it about a half a dozen times i've lost one i've drawn once maybe twice and i've won like three times so i'm now getting a good feel for this army and I'm, I like the NATO green here color. So if you guys would give me some help on what would, would be a good color to go with the NATO green. Like I said, that's Dark Angels green there, and that's that orc shade black. Don't really like that. Uh, like I said, someone suggested a brown, but I'm not sure what color browns. But anyways, I'm starting to ramble. Anyways, time to put the smack down on the bugs. And I'm hoping to do a battle report on the new Tyranids. So... Oh, excuse me. So you guys have a good day and let's see how it goes. Bye.